Hello there, in this video we're going to look at a Team Fortress 2 custom map called Dry Seas. We'll start on red. So this is where the players they spawn on red. So this is their base control point. There's some stairs that lead down to a basement. And now it will quickly restart. Eat my dust. So up here there's an advantage point. This can obviously be used, this right here as well. I guess a heavy or medics can camp here. Or even the demo man. See if we can get up here. Well, scouts can at least get up here. And I've tried this map once, just to see if it works. It's a very simple designed map, but it, the idea is brilliant in my opinion. So this is like a small vantage point for snipers to come up here. This is also a pretty new map. It's 11 days old, I think it says on Game Banana. But again, it's called Dry Seas, and as you can see, pretty much there's no water here at all. So I guess it used to be uh, maybe oil rigs, these two here, two buildings on each side. And all the, water, all the water is gone, the ocean, and basically now there is just ships in the, in, the, in the sand that's left. I really like that idea, I think it's very special. But this map is also very identical on each side. So each side has a small tower over here. And I guess this is mainly for snipers. And there's a big error here, I don't know why. I guess it's the creator, he used some custom model. And obviously I don't have that, so it will show a big error. Okay, so scouts they can get up here. Not that it is that good for them anyway. They're not very good at long range. So basically there's a walk path around here on the building. So you can get up on each side. And on each side there's also these <laughs> rockets. And some cement I believe. Now last time I tried this map I could get up here. So okay there we go. But basically, I guess only scouts can get up here. Strange, I do remember I got up here as well. So, for some reason, I just can't get up. So, we'll just continue over here. And basically, this up here, you see, is actually the skybox. And that is these rock formations around, and this the sand desert, and... I guess also the ship, as you can see up there. I don't know why, why the skybox is up there, but... Oh well, I hope for the creator you will change that, because it looks a bit stupid. So, so here are some containers, I guess snipers that can use this also, as cover and surprise attacks. So, the main bridge where most of the players will be going. So here is one of the control points. There's nothing else around here, as you can see. So we'll continue on over. And this is the blues side, and I guess you have to capture that point to capture this one. And vice versa, if you're on blue. So as you can see, they have pretty much the same. Everything is just identical to the red side. Sure, it actually looks a little bit brighter over here. Could be it's the crates or something. Also the rockets here and so on. Even the the cement. I really like that detail with the big container ship. That looks really good for the skybox.
even over here you can get up so I guess scouts they can actually use that as an advantage to get over here and you can do some surprise attacks so I guess we've covered the whole map so far and if you fall down you die instantly you can't really run around down there even though I'd say the the invisible death wall is somewhere there because you die really fast as you can see now even over here you can actually go over and camp as a sniper slightly tricky but there you go so you've got a nice nice little camping spot here we can go out and peek and I also noticed that the ground textures over here and I believe also on the other side it looks like mo the moon basically with these small craters here so that's a bit weird of a texture to use in my opinion it also doesn't sound like you're running on metal sounds like dirt even looks like it when you shoot it I will quickly go in no clip and take a look around anything inside oh there's nothing at all okay so obviously we can see now where the skybox is where the, the whole map is and in general where the lines are for the skybox yep Set up to the skybox and see how, how it looks like. So yeah, this is pretty much how the skybox is. A few rock formations and this container ship. Okay, so we're gonna do a bot match and see how it goes. Very hectic with soldiers. Oh man. As you see, this is going to be one of the main parts of the map where it's just going to go absolutely chaotic. <laughs> yeah, I am probably going to go down soon. Wow, blue is really kicking out ass. Oh, okay, maybe not. Ready to charge. Strange they haven't come out yet. Maybe they I have a hard time figuring out how to get out onto the, the middle of the bridge. So, the last control point. Oh, there's a sentry. <laughs> yeah, that is suicide right there. Sniper now and see how that goes. But the map is great in my opinion. I really like it, guys. I think it's brilliant for Team Fortress 2. Just seeing the whole team run out there is just absolutely amazing. Oh wow, he's running up there. So 
You can actually see as a sniper, you can see them through the windows. Just barely. Wow, they just got massacred. As a sniper, they just not doing anything, huh? Oh, what the Weird. Maybe they are stuck? I guess they are. Since they aren't coming out. Strange. Okay, there's none down there. Not me up there either. Let's just go and look. Yeah, they must be stuck in there. Oh wow, well, it's just budge. I mean, with other real players, it's gonna be different. Oh, they're not there at all. Oh wow! <laughs> They're all hiding there. Wow. I have to take a screenshot of that. It's just brilliant. Oh. <laughs> wow. So that's what the butts do. They run into the cement container if they lose. That's pretty hilarious. But this must also be a uh, sniper's map, definitely. I mean, it's so open. So there's probably going to be a lot of snipers to play against other players. That's obviously a spy over there. Ooh, I think there's another sniper there over there, he's getting me. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, this is definitely a sniper's map. Let's try another class now. Oh well, no chance. <laughs> Well, I think we should call it for now, guys. Now we've basically seen how the map works with butts. A very entertaining map, guys. I definitely like it. I think it's a brilliant idea. It's something different compared to all the other common Team Fortress 2 maps. So I'll provide a link in the description if you want to download this map out yourself and try it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.